hello everybody hello 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 um welcome to my channel i appreciate you guys being here thank you for tuning in this reading is going to be for cancer sun moon or rising i encourage you guys um to look at all um your uh zodiac readings all the zodiac reading all the zodiacs that you are comprised of your your moon your rising and especially your venus if you're looking for uh, messages about love okay um, if you're not sure about how to do that, just go to Google and put in Sun, Moon, and Rising Calculator, okay? And then you'll um, find out all the zodiac signs that you are comprised of, all right? So, Cancer, Sun, Moon, or Rising. Emotions, emotions, emotions is what I keep hearing. Emotions, someone staying up late at night. You guys could be stressed about a love situation, okay? You could... um. <clears throat> Be stressed about your, your situations with relationships as a whole, okay? that That's what I'm hearing. Um, there's a new beginning that you guys seem to be embarking upon. And the new beginning has a lot to do with truth, okay? The eye in the sky, the eye in the sky, the, the truth is coming from directly from your ancestors from your kindred spirits okay your community of ancestors these 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 um downloads that you are receiving because they are downloads they could be happening while you are sleeping okay coming di directly from nature and by nature i mean the universe Okay, you are receiving direct downloads. You could be feeling um changes in your body, um, especially after you um have just woken up. Okay, there's some type of upgrade, a spiritual upgrade that's going on that I see. They there are there's clarity um by way of emotions, if that makes sense. Okay, so this is healing energy. This is um this is emotional st emotional truth okay because you know you could have been this is all come coming from a guardian angel okay you could have been in a situation where you know your emotions were manipulated this is a direct download from spirit the universe your ancestor who may have been even been a Pisces, but it's like they're coming to you or well, any water sign. If they're coming to you and they're giving you hope by way of restored emotions, if that makes sense. Okay. There is some type of release that needs to happen. Crowning, crowning your reading. It could be a way of thinking. This is a reoccurring theme in all of my readings. Okay. It seems like universally, um, as a collective, we are all in the energy of trying to or needing to release a person, place, or thing, a thought form, what have you. For someone, it is a job situation, okay? For someone, this is actually um, ha dealing with abundance in the way you make your money. Um. There's a situation that I want to bring attention to where it's like you um have embodied the energy of the empress where you know you 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 take things in, you cultivate it, you love on it, okay, you nurture it. <laughs> and you know, if this is a situation where you have been stabbing your back plenty and many of times or had your feelings manipulated and giving your nurturing, loving, caring energy to the wrong people, places and things. It's like during this time of quiet or stillness, maybe even while you were sleeping in a dream state, God, the universe, your ancestors, whomever blessed you with <laughs> um, the king of swords energy um, through an emotional download, which is this is emotional clarity where it's like I am no longer accepting um drawing in energy especially that of those who are toxic or things people places and things that are toxic i am now putting my sword up and creating a boundary and i think that is beautiful <laughs> okay there, there's boundaries here because now with this download that you received it's like oh now i know who you are now i know what you are now i know um what it is that you stand for 
<clears throat> and you know now I'm going to be taking inventory of who and what I allow into my life instead of always being the empress and wanting to fix love and nurture individuals um places and things that don't deserve it that are a waste of my time that are toxic to me okay let's see what Okay, this emotional download, this emotional clarity is going to help you to release this person, place, or thing, okay? And look, the love you have shared is eternal regardless of the situation. So, yeah, okay, this this is in, this for some of you guys, this is in reference to a person and it's like, yeah, you loved this person and they did love you. However... <laughs> however okay it is time for you to be bold and release the details of the situation release needing answers okay because we have already gifted you with that release reliance on this person release wanting to fix someone okay release your attachment to this person place or thing Thought form. Period. Release it. Okay. Okay. You are experiencing enormous change right now, which brings great blessings. So this is what I was saying about that trans that 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 energy of of that download. Okay. This is what I was saying about that energy of. You know, I went to sleep for a couple nights and. You know, it's like some, some, there's a, there's work on, on a crown chakra being done. Okay. There's work on the, on the emotional energy. And this, this is, this, this, that the angels, that the angels brought to you. It's like, this is going to help you release. This person is also going to help you have hope that there's a future. Okay. For this new beginning, for this new beginning. Somebody feels like a newborn baby. Somebody feels like a newborn baby. Okay. Yes, look at that. Receptivity. Allow yourself to receive. This will increase your intuition, energy, and ability to give to others. So this is what I was saying about that message that's coming through from spirit, the universe, your ancestors, whoever, whatever you would like to... Uh, deem it as who, whoever it is for you okay whoever you deem to be your higher power okay so they are uh, are um confirming that they are trying to gift you with things and um give you these downloads and they want you to be open to receiving and not give any resistance um so that they could get the message and um regenerate i just heard you you as a as a whole Okay, as a whole. Okay, so <clears throat> this energy of that I'm looking at with this deprivation here, I said something about um, uh, someone's place of work i started to feel like someone may have lost a job or disconnected from um some toxic way of making money okay well not toxic way of making money a uh, toxic environment where you made your money is what i should say um <clears throat> some type of toxic financial environment or even some toxic way of looking at money Okay, this is this this is all about emotions. This is all about emotions. Yeah. There's there's some type of lack mentality. There's a there's a there's a lack mentality going on where it's like I don't have, there isn't enough, I'm stressed, anxiety, discontentment. Okay. I, so somebody you sit you're sitting on a throne and you don't even realize it is what I just heard because you've been deceived so many times. Yeah, this is this is a this is some type of lack mentality. Um, 
For someone I just heard that you put yourself in situations. You put yourself in situations, um, in toxic situations, okay? And then because of lack of better judgment and then get upset when you get the shit end of the stick, all right? <laughs> I'm just the messenger, okay? But that's what it sounds like. Overcoming difficulties. The worst is now behind you and you are surmounting any previous challenges. Okay. So with like I said, you are actually on top, you know, of not on top of your game, but you are smooth, not smooth sailing, but you are sailing. You're still you're still moving. Okay. Um and even though you're feeling deprived, I'm looking at it and it's like, you know, this is a lack mentality. It isn't really that bad, um, especially when it comes to, um, you know, your overall way of looking at life. A lot of the situations is seeming like, you know, it's um, your nurturing spirit that puts you there. Can I say that? Um, I am helping you with your spiritual soulmate relationship. Okay. So the angels, like I said, the angels are <clears throat> confirming yet again that you are receiving these downloads from them and they're trying to help you. Okay. They're trying to help. So the information that you receive, the epiphanies, the aha moments is all coming from your spirit team. Okay. Yes, Cancer, you are showing up in your own reading, upright, steadfast, ready to move forward, okay? Someone does feel brand new. Look at that, bottom of the deck, as I say, steadfast, ready to move forward. Yes, new beginning, beginnings, bring them to me, okay? You feel like this or you will feel like this because... Um, of your angels and your spirit team and that's beautiful okay that brings us to the energy of new life new life new life new beginning you see that here what's up with this new life and this, this new beginning what do you have to say about that spirit look at that new life new beginning that's gemini energy you may have gemini in your chart okay you may have gemini in your chart after you receive some healing Okay, you may be dealing with an Aquarius as well. After you receive this download of emotional healing, you are ready to move forward, okay? You're ready to balance. You know, there's, even with this, okay, there's the energy of balancing, balancing. You see the two? The two, this is, this is um, taking your... Your likes, your dislikes, your accomplishments, your faults, your yin, your yang, your negative, your positive, and still moving forward, okay? I just heard emotional intelligence, strength, balance, endurance. These are the words that I'm hearing. Fire in your belly, I just heard. Okay, someone, someone, um, there's someone who may be blessed with, um, literally may be blessed with a, a new child, a new baby, or some type of project, new project. There's something that is going to be birthed from this, um, beautiful new surge of energy and, um, new beginning. So, you know what to do. Trust your inner wisdom and act upon it without delay. Okay? So, they're saying, listen, we told you. We told you. We told you. Okay? We gave you that inner wisdom. So, for for a lot of you, it's, 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 you know you need to release this person. Okay? Or this thing. Whatever. Whatever this is for you, whatever, however this applies to you, okay? At the bottom of the deck, endings and beginnings. The old must be released, re released so that the new can enter. Yes, it does, okay? And I said that. I've said that. You know, universally, as a collective, we it looks like we're all getting ready to, preparing for, are in the middle of, releasing 
what does not serve us no matter how bad or how real the love was. Hmm. No matter how um, hell-bent we were on trying to make this situation work. If it's not for you, if it's stunting your spiritual, mental, physical <laughs> health and growth, okay? If, it, if it's holding back your transformation, if it is clouding your judgment, if it is, um, yeah, okay. Surrender your fear of change. The universe is reminding you that you are cared for always, whether you're afraid of change in your job, your health, or a relationship, or if you fear aging or death. Repeat the affirmation, I have faith that all is well. I have faith that all is well. I have faith that all is well. So remember what I was saying. This is basically what this reading is centered around. It's just like... You know, um, whether you're afraid of changing your job, we mentioned that, in your health or a relationship. Okay? Trust in the universe. Okay? Um, I hope that helped. Let me check one. Um, yeah. Yeah. Um, at the bottom of the deck, it's so funny because over here at the bottom of the deck, we have surrendered to the wisdom of your body. Listen to your body's messages about a person or situation. If you feel physically drained or uncomfortable, be cautious. If you are energized and happy, move forward. This has a lot to do with what I said about you receiving the download. You could wake up feeling some type of drunken energy. Um, this, this emotional intelligence is what I was talking about, about, you know, um, receiving, already having something um, encoded or something like that in your DNA, which where it's like, oh, I, I know and I receive this information information emotionally that I can never, um, I don't resonate with that anymore. I don't resonate with that person. Uh, probably never really did, okay? But this is something where it's like, this is the wrong person, place, or thing for me, okay? So I hope that helped you guys.